What's going on guys, Buck here, and I'm gonna be reading the patch notes that they put out for the ranked match making that they're gonna be adding into the game. Sometime this week, is it is the 27th of April today, and sometime this week, they're gonna be adding the ranked mode in. So this is a video format of it for you guys. If you wanna give it a read, link is down below if you wanna read it yourselves. I already read it, so uh, if you guys wanna listen up, I'm gonna be doing it in this format to make it a little bit easier for you guys. Um, so to start, they have five bullet points that they're going to be talking about in this article. And the first one is that the you need to complete 20 unranked matches before you have access to competitive mode, which is not too hard to get. Um, each or There's eight ranks in the game. Each rank has three tiers, except for the top rank, which is Valorant. The ranks will go as follows. You have Iron, Bronze, Silver, Gold, Platinum, Diamond, Immortal and Valorant and the way that works is after you play your 20 games I'm assuming you'll have to play some placement matches in ranked and or it might just place you and once you get placed You'll get placed into one of these uh, Ranks here and you have to work your way up So you get placed let's say into bronze one and if you get placed in bronze one you'll have to uh, Compete and gain enough um, Or win enough to be placed into bronze two then three and then you get placed to silver one And that's how the ranking system works for games like this uh, and all it says here is if you haven't played for 14 days, your rank won't be displayed. However, you will not lose your rank over time. And your rank for closed beta does not carry over to launch. And that's the five bullet points they talk about it all in this uh, article here. I'd recommend giving it a read if you want to go in depth on those points. And the other uh, section they have here is about the integrity. And basically what this whole article here says is that uh, you'll be placed with people your your skill level and they're going to try really hard to kind of separate the smurfs and people that are really good and they're going to try to keep you with people that are your skill level so there's kind of two ranking systems there's your rank and your, there's your hidden mmr they call it and they're going to be placing you with your people that are the same hidden mmr rank as you as opposed to just flat out what you're actually ranked as so that that's their way of kind of keeping it um fair for you even if you know, you're the same rank as someone, but they're way better. It might be harder to be placed with them. Uh, and then another thing they talk about in here, which I really like, and it's a really good point. Uh, if you're losing a game, don't give up because however much you lost that game by, or maybe won that game by, will determine whether how or how much you lose rank or gain rank. So they want to make sure that you guys are trying throughout the entire game and not just giving up and throwing games because you'll actually lose more rank if you throw games. And that's what this part here talks about. Uh, yeah, that's the video format of this article here. If you guys want to give it a read again, link down below. I have my Twitch and Discord down below as well. If you guys want to follow that, feel free. I'm going to be doing updates for this game every time they release a new patch. And if you want to party up, my Discord link is there. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.